today I'm heading to the beach for one hour only and let's see what I can find. Remember guys if you do enjoy watching my fossil hunting videos please consider hitting that subscribe button and giving the video a like if you've enjoyed it. It's looking very good down there look at all them rocks all washed up. Piece of fossil wood, huge and heavy. Towards the end of the video, I'm going to show you a lovely articulated bit of ichthyosaur spine that I found last year. So definitely stick around till the end to see that. That's an easy find, nice little hillbosterus just laying here. Very water worn, but still an easy pick up. A nice Dactyliosaurus, again water worn, well worth putting in the bag. I can see a very wave worn ammonite inside there. Yep, you can see the edge just peeking out. I've just found this big piece of rock with the edge of an ammonite sticking out. It could well be really water worn, but I'm going to give it a tap with my hammer and see if anything comes out of it. Unfortunately, it's not all there, just a little bit on the side. Well, there's plenty to look through anyway. This rock is absolutely packed full of crinoid, really warm pieces. You can see it running right through the rock. Little teeny fish scales. And there's a little ammonite impression on the side. Nope, already opened. Can you spot that ammonite? Fortunately, it's not complete. Just a little section missing. One slab of bellamites. Well, a few little bellamites on there. Two good looking nodules right next to each other. There's a cannonball nodule here with some shells and stuff peeking out and there's a nodule here. That looks quite good. And it's empty. Well it's popped open. I think it was full of minerals. Yep. See down here this rock is full of teeny little ammonites just down there it's wedged underneath this big boulder though so i'm not going to try and get it out nice looking cannonball that could well just pop open nicely if there's anything inside See, this rock is absolutely packed full of little ammonites. Just picked up these two nodules. There's a partial here poking out. Look, definitely a partial. And there's another nodule with a little keel poking out just here. In fact, there's two in there. Look. Can you see both little keels poking out? That's really cool. Dactyliosaurus on the floor. Now I'm starting to make my way back. I'm approaching the 40 minute mark. I've got a good few ammonite nodules in my bag.
I do love it when all the rocks bank up like this. It makes fossil hunting just that little bit more easier. Can you make that out? There's a pyrite nodule absolutely full of Elegantisserus ammonites. I'm going to tap that little edge off and let's see if it pops any good and if there's any full ammonites inside. It can sometimes be a little bit sticky. And it's broken open. You can see there's already one ammonite which has fallen out. Definitely take that bit back. Oh wow, look at that. Just all fallen out. Two lovely little ammonites. And if you look on the rock, you can see there's actually no more ammonites in there. So I've just got the two more complete ones, which is quite handy. I haven't really got time to open the nodules what I've picked up, but I'll show you at home how many I've picked up. Hello everyone, I'm back up from the beach now. I just really quickly wanted to show you the finds from today. So all of these little nodules, what you can see here, have signs of ammonites peeking out. I'm going to split them open at some point. There's this lovely wave worn Hildoceros that I found. All of these nodules here have no sign of ammonites poking out. So I'm going to crack them open and see if there's any fossils inside. There's a little piece of a belemite shown here. So there could be something decent in. Lovely pebble containing many ammonites really cool so as i originally promised on the beach here is a lovely section of four articulated marine reptile vertebra i originally found it encased in rock so i had it professionally prepared to show the stunning detail of the bone articulated marine reptile vertebra are very rare so i'm really pleased to have this lovely piece in my collection. Here's a little bonus find which I recently had prepared. It's a lovely Elegantisserus ammonite. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video guys. Remember to hit that subscribe button and give the video a like if you've enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more fossil hunts.